This is a little aside. I've uh, got the um, Pico uh, Pico Pewter here, so that's running an emulated uh, transputer. But all I'm using it for here is to get a 5 meg clock for the link adapter chip here. <coughs> the um, Arduino is hooked up to the link adapter, that's fine. But I've put some extra jumpers here which haven't got any links on them at the moment. Which means that the link going into the link adapter is coming off this board here. This is a small transputer board. We've got an IMST 425 there. That's a transputer. Uh, it's got some memory. Not sure how much it's got. Not really too bothered at the moment. And I've connected the link to the li link zero to the transputer to the link adapter on the Arduino board. And that's going in this connector here. So this is designed to have a load of boards plugged in which have other transputers on them. And link zero currently comes out of here. And I've also had to put another jumper on this purple wire, and that's just to uh, get the transputer out of reset. I think it was the job of this card to actually get that transputer out of reset. Don't really know why. Um, there's a reset circuit here. I reverse engineered it and worked out that I can jumper that. So this is all powered up at the moment. This is on, that's on. It's not displaying anything at the moment. But if I run my server program on the PC, which is exactly what I run with the Pico computer, you can see Hello World just appeared there. Now, Hello World is not in the code for the Arduino. It's coming from the program which has been sent over the USB through the link adapter into Link Zero. And this transputer is set up to boot from ROM. So that sort of validates in another way the Pico computer because that would do exactly the same thing when I loaded the program into that as the real transputer does. So uh, yeah, that was quite nice when I finally got it working. In a way, couldn't really go wrong because this is a transputer emulator and I'm using the same protocol because I'm using the link adapter here to uh, write the code over on the um, Pico and um, it works there, works on real hardware. So uh, there we go.